Let's go with jeans. Right. <clears throat> Do we want a a standard farm and s a simple plot of land with a large amount of open space to design your farm? Oh, that sounds cool. We've got Riverland Farm. Your farm is spread across several islands and scenic riverbanks. Fish are more common here than usual. Oh shit, fishing. Forest farm, which is the one that I always go for, because it's, it's beautiful. The woods limit your farming space, however, the bounty of the forest is nearly at your doorstep. Hilltop, rocky terrain and a winding river makes it difficult to design your farm. However, a mineral deposit provides mining, mining opportunities. Um, I feel like the music's loud. Let's go back a minute. Oh, wait. Can't you edit? Right, we'll have to... I'm not doing this all over again now. <laughs> um, Rose. I'll have to turn down the music in a bit. I might try the standard farm or the riverbank. I'm still gaming. Tears are really cute. You know, I'm gonna go for standard overalls. Good foraging and fishing, and tons of open space. Sometimes supply crates wash up on shore, however, sprinklers don't work in the sandy soil. That's a bit. Four Corners Farm. That sounds cool. The land is divided into four parcels, each with its own perk. Perfect for a group. I'm not even in a group. Let's go with the um, standard. Standard. <clears throat> and for my very special granddaughter. <laughs> I want you to have the sealed envelope.
No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. Okay, Grandad. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Every single day. <laughs> and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Okay. Now let Grandpa rest. Rest in peace. <laughs> oh! Reminds me of the Simpsons a little bit. Oh, there we are. I think that's us? Yeah. Why is there a skeleton in there? Okay, dear Rose, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago, I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Daydream Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all. Sorry about that. And now it's yours. I know you, you'll you honour the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Imagine your grandpa dies and he just leaves you, like, a farm. P.S. If Lucy's still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? Oh, alright then. It's funny how that bus works now, but when you get to Stardew Valley, it doesn't work. Or is that a different bus? Robin! Hello, you must be Rose. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. Is there right now of tidying things up for your arrival? The farm's right over here if you follow me. Can we, um, go to settings yet? Your progress has been served. Oh, did I skip that? I did not mean to skip. Oh well. If you played this game before, you'll know what <laughs> happens. That's a bit better. Is that better? Is it too quiet? Fish bite sound. I feel my time. So, um, um, I play Stardew Valley a lot on my Nintendo Switch. This is the first time I'm actually playing it on an Xbox or something like that. So yeah, audio seems okay. <laughs> Are you sure BRSP? Because I know what happened last time. I'm joking. Oh, it's a lot more different on the Xbox, I was like, because we choose a different farm. Parsnips! Hey, look, I'm joking, okay? <laughs> Let's see what the outside of our farm's like, though. I'm scared. Why 
is not too bad. It's gonna take me a while to get used to playing it on the Xbox because I'm used to playing it on the uh, Switch. What do I need to create a chest? 50 pieces of wood. We can do that. We can do that easily. I hope. I've just realised you can't see my energy. <laughs> I've just been looking around thinking, where's the energy thing? It's hidden. settings again. Options. Uh, just green size. There we go. No, I couldn't see the energy. Um, I had it hidden for some reason. I don't want it to. Yeah, he's alright then. Piers is um the bar up in here. <laughs> I know we don't have a lot of money, but I'm running out of energy already. I guess we should probably go into town and do some introductions. Introduction. And I cannot speak. Ha! Ha! Maya Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Mane. 
I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. I, I, I definitely will. Hello, Doctor. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. Okay. Uh, it's hello. This Leah. Um, I think Leah is super adorable. Hello, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. So we've met Leah, we've met uh, um, Abigail. Oh, that's right. I heard someone knew was moving onto that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Well, you can't do that now, can you? Hello, you must be Rose, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband runs the general store here, and have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple <laughs> The pale one! <laughs> oh, savage. Hey, it's Miss Rose, the new farmer. I'm Pia, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Depends how good the price is gonna bid though. You know? Alright. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're going to get along great. I'm Alex. I'll see you around. Okay, bye. Penny! Oh, uh, hello, I'm Penny. That's, that's all she's gonna say. Evelyn! <laughs> Why, oh, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. Evelyn is the most loveliest person ever. You can call me Granite if you like. Okay, Granite. <laughs> where's Isa? Oh, I'm gonna say, where's George? <laughs> Um, it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Um, <laughs> he's the mean old man, but you gotta love him. By the way, if you're looking to mods, I hope you're prepared to sacrifice another. <laughs> I don't think you can actually get mods for the Xbox, because that's what I'm playing it on. Um, but, I'm hoping that once I get a, play a proper computer, then we will, we will be messing around with mods, because I've seen the game with mods. Oh, you are exactly how I imagined, but that's okay, I'm Jodie. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farm around could really change things. Well, good job that I'm here. <laughs> Vincent! Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. So yeah, maybe once I get like um, a proper computer, we can look into the mods. Oh, he's not in. Alright, who's in here? That? Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Where's your bratty sister? Is there anyone at the beach? Elliot! Ha! The new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. 
He's such a gentleman. No, don't water the sand. That's not what we want to do. It's a bit dry at the moment. Let me get a drink. <sighs> Alright, so we've spoken to Penny. <coughs> Oh, aren't you the one who just moved to him? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. <laughs> okay. I've seen people make their um, Stardew Valley game look all pink and that and... Uh, I get jealous. Hey kid, the name's Pam. Don't be a jerk and we'll get along fine. Okay, Pam. <gasps> there he is! Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Oh, all right. I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She is interested to meet you. Yeah, we've actually just spoken to her. Alright, where's your grumpy son? Is he stuck in his bedroom? That's Sebastian! Sebastian, come out so that I can introduce myself. <laughs> Where's Linus? Is he out? Oh, he is. A stranger. Hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. I kind of feel sorry for him. is there? I've got eight more people to... seven or eight more people to introduce myself to. Let me go on to... So we've got Haley, Clint, Gus, Shane, Sebastian, the wizard, is that Jazz, Willie, and that's it. on the inside of the pub or oh, the saloon yet yeah. I don't know you why are you talking to me I feel like Shane and Pam would be a good couple but isn't he like a bit young everything's gonna be close now isn't it Oh, she's here. Oh, you're that new farmer, girl, or whatever, aren't you? Huh? Oh, hi, Melee. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be pretty. Actually, never mind. I'm wearing overalls. What are you on about? 
See what I mean when I say she's bright? She's bright. <coughs> I hate her. Uh, least last romantic option. Same. I don't like Alex either. Those two deserve each other. They're perfect for each other. <laughs> I don't have enough room in my inventory. There we go. <laughs> I myself, I am an Abigail simp. Abigail is so cute. Um, I've never really tried to date a girl before in Stardew Valley. I... <clears throat> the first time I actually played Stardew Valley, I showed an interest to Alex. He was just easy, but then I went off of him. I started again, and then I went to Sam. We became boyfriend and girlfriend, and now I'm interested in both Sam and Sebastian in my new village on my Nintendo. <laughs> so we might have a bit of a love triangle going on at the moment. I recommend it. Oh, interesting. Those options say a lot about a person. They really do. <laughs> so, so yeah, I think both of them have got three hearts. Oh, no, I forgot to do my... Uh... So, yeah, it's, it's a messy situation, but... We do try. <laughs> Maybe um, on this um, gameplay we can try and get a, a girl. Oh, not that one. Go away. Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie. Guess we're gonna go see Willie. I need to get some wood. So that I can build a chest.
be a bad idea to put it next to the storage unit thing, but oh well. We should probably go see Willy in a minute. Let's go do that now. Quest, go away. No, oh, do not throw the axe away. Trying to keep the art of fishing alive. I'll pay 98 gil to any fishing and fuse the axe to catch his fee. Why did I accept that quest? I cannot fish in this game. Fishing in Stardew Valley is so hard. Right, Vincent, where's your little friend? Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. <laughs> uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any ar artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Of course I will. What's up with you? Sigh. Mom won't, mom won't let me have any more gummies today. <laughs> Parking. <laughs> well, I mean, it's 10 30 in the morning. You shouldn't have been having gummies anyway. Hi. <laughs> Let's go see Willy. There it is. <clears throat> Ahoy there, miss. <laughs> Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. The sense of time in this game is disturbing. I know, right? It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Am I going to use the bamboo pole? No, I'm going to get the training one. There's good water in the valley, all kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Hey, <laughs> hey. That's what me old pappy used to say anyway. Could be worse, it could have been daddy. Ugh. I hate that word. <laughs> um, let me buy a trading rod. How much is it? 25. <laughs> I'll, I'll take that. Uh, let me see what fishing's like on, on the Xbox. Is it still going to be hard? I even catch a fish then. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, we've got some fish. We can actually save that for the um, community centre. Wait, is fishing that easy on the Xbox? Or did it just do that for the tutorial? Have a look. All right. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> Sad. All right. I think I need to do some more introductions. Yeah. Sebastian in his room still. Class. <laughs> Sebastian, come out. I mean, as a fellow emo myself, I, I get it. I, I, I get it. But I, I need to reintroduce myself to you. And I can't do it if you're still in your room. Who else is there? This is Sebastian, Gus, and Clint. Thinking I'm playing on the switch and I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Is she not in a good mood? Mm -hmm. No, I got him in a shop. Uh, hi, I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Okay. Thank you, Clint. You know what, kids? <laughs> He's still soaking about the gummies. Ah, oh, Sam. Oh, hi. It's good to see you again. Take it easy. Man of words. Man of words. Sebastian out here. Well, hello there, I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Hi, please relax and enjoy yourself. smoking yet. <sighs> Disappointment. Disappointment.
Your disappointment is immeasurable, clearly. Yeah. Look, this guy spends too much time in his room. All I want to do is just say hi, and I can't even do that. Sebastian, you need to go for a smoke. It's a cigarette break. I know you're working on that, but... You need to come out. Oh, I don't think I'll want that. <laughs> I'm just gonna stand here until he comes out. Tell your brothers come out. Good. Go on then. Got a little visitor from my dog. Oh, he's out! Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you choose Pelican Town. Wait for Buddy and Muffin. Give someone a gift. <laughs> Sebastian, do you like flowers? <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> oh, you're going to have to make some streaming? What's up? <laughs> I'll be done in a bit, alright? Give me... 40 minutes. Alright? Yeah? <laughs> Just gonna scratch it back then, alright? What do you think Sebastian has done with the flowers? Do you think he's thrown them in the pond? And be like, ooh, this is gross. Get these things away from me. No, I don't saw that. Do not sell that. It's not really when I can't go into the mimes.
what am I supposed to do? Another miserable day in paradise. See what this place is like. <laughs> oh, it's not too bad actually. There's a lot of room, which is pretty cool. See what if we've got any shells at the beach. No, Stardew Rain does that to me all of the time. It's so cozy in Carbon. So, was your first night in the old cottage? Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that horse. Oh, we got a lot of shells. <coughs> the sound of starter rain. So good.
Let's see if we can get into the mines. <laughs> no, listening to this rain is making me yawn. Can't go inside. <laughs> um, got any quests? Nah. I oh know what's in that getting started. Oh, cool. It's right now. Just do pass it. I guess we're just gonna have to like do some pick up some random stuff to earn money. Sebastian at the beach. <coughs> Emo boy loves going to the beach on a rainy day. Nah, it's not. Fish for shit in this game. Come on, fish it up. Do not be stubborn. <laughs> I have to dip a dip dip, but I hope there's you stream and night's closing as well. It's alright. Um, I think I'm gonna be going soon anyway. So. But no, have a nice night. Um, thank you for joining me and watching the stream. And I hope to see you next time. Have a nice night. Thank you for joining and I'll see you later. Do, do, do.
Has the spring onions here on ground? Let's go over here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm passing into this well. I've been streaming for two hours and fifty nine minutes. <sighs> I guess we'll do one more day and then I'll say goodbye. Oh, foraging. Oh, we got a lot of money there. I'll take that. 